Good morning, guys. So I am about to brush my teeth, but I wanted to show you something since uh, you're following along with me on my hair care journey, and I know it's a mess. I just woke up, I just got out of bed, but I wanted to show you something. In my process of searching for products that are healthier and better and things that I can make at home with products that I already have or are easy to find, um, I have been doing research about toothpaste. And I know that I can buy some homemade natural tooth powder or toothpaste um, from other people here on TikTok. Some of my goal has been to learn how to make it myself and how to use, again, ingredients that I already have, that I already am knowledgeable about, and so that I can use it time and time again, make it time and time again. So about six months ago, I finally found a recipe with just five ingredients, I think, five or six ingredients that I fully understand, believe in, and that I have in my house. And I made it. And I wanted to see what I thought if I was even going to use it and if my family was even going to use it. And it turns out everyone loves it. It's right here. It's got bentonite clay, kaolin clay, three different essential oils. And you know I love me some essential oils. A little bit of baking soda to help with a little whitening. I mean, I love it so much. It's turned my son's teeth from yellow to white, like within a week. And everything in this, all this, all these ingredients help with cavities, enamel growth. I mean, it helps with it all. Um, it helps with any bleeding gums. I'm so happy and bad breath because of the some one of the essential oils helps with any bacterial growth. I loved it so much that I was thinking mm, it'd be fun to make it for other people. So I've made it for a few other people, but then me having a marketing background and I love building brands. Oh, I love building brands. I actually made a brand, Naturally Lazy. <laughs> it's a brand for people that um, want to make homemade items, want to make homemade products, but they're too freaking busy. They're too freaking wrapped up in their own lives to source products, to freaking find the recipes that work for them, um, and then to make them, and then to continue making them every day. Because as much as we'd all love to be homesteaders and um, not in the matrix, not have to deal with the matrix, so most of us are, but that doesn't mean that we all don't want to have natural products, right? So we're just a little bit naturally lazy. Get it? So I'd love your thoughts on that a little bit, but um, yeah, because I'd, I'd love to build the brand on it. I think that it could have more products. I mean, it could have the tooth powder, it could have the homemade deodorant, it could have um, the laundry, the laundry detergent that I make that is not detergent at all. Um, it could have the the dry shampoos. Um, it could have a bunch of different things that I use around the house, the recipes that I've already tried, the recipes that I've perfected, the recipes that I know work. I know, I know, there are a lot of brands out there, but why couldn't this be a brand? I think it'd be a great damn brand. I can see it in, you know, little stores too subscription services so you never have to think about going to a store and buying toothpaste the shit that causes cancer that causes the gums to recede that causes you know the bacteria to grow causes mouth cancer throat cancer we don't want that we don't want that we want products that make us healthier that keep us healthy, keep us strong. Anyways, I'm baffling now. Love your thoughts. And for those of you that have never used a tooth powder, which I never did until I made this, I wanna show you how it works. So you have your tooth brush, get it wet, dip it into the tooth powder. You got it like that. There we go, looks like that. And then just brush. Oh, uh, so good. 
Your mouth will never feel as clean as it does after using this. All day, it feels clean. It doesn't matter what you have, I'm telling you. Anyway.